Alright guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to download and install Multi5. It's a multiplayer mod for GTA 5 where you can go online and just have mods, but it's like separate servers from GTA, so you can't get banned for this. So what you want to do is download client, click download client on the download link I'll have in the description. Click download client, you have to download all three of these. DLCs is 12 gigs, so if it takes a really long time, it's supposed to do that. After you click download all three of these, download them and put them on your desktop. When you're on the desktop, you should have three of them. I'm not going to have DLCs here just because it takes forever to download and put here. Once you have these, you extract them. It's pretty easy to extract and just hit the extract button. You do that for all three of them. And then once you do that, you open your GTA 5 directory. This is how you get to it. You open your Steam. If you're using Steam, this is going to be the Steam version, how to install it because there's two different ways. When you're in Steam, you hit Properties, Local Files, and then Browse Local Files. You can just close that. Then once you're here, once you get Patch Extracted, you want to open Update X64, and then DLC Packs. I forgot which one it was real quick. And then once you did that, you just want to put the Extracted Patch in there like I have there. And that should be it for that. And then you still want to come back out here. I don't know if I just did it like this and it worked for me. I took the two files that were in patched. And my computer won't left click anymore. You take these two and I just put them right in the GTA 5 main directory. Because it, for the Steam version you have to. Then after you do that, you can take, you take 0.2.4.zip. And when you extract that, that'll give you like what I have here. Like I'll just go ahead and extract it. Doesn't take that long to extract these. Yeah, once you get that extracted, you open it. And you put multi five in here. Yeah, you unpack it to any folder, just not the GTA 5 folder. So yeah, you can just leave that on your desktop. I put it in my GTA 5 mods folder just because it's cleaner for the desktop since I have so much stuff on it. So yeah, then you just make your shortcut and put it on here so it looks like I did. So you just left click it and it opens. Then you take the... DLCs and you put DLCs into the main folder here. Yeah, you just put DLCs into the main folder. Like what I have there. That just will take a little while to do since there's so much stuff in it. You just put the extracted one there. And that should be it. Once you click multi five to open it for the first time, it should download everything that it needs, like all the game cache. And that's it for multi five there. Then to download GTA or Five Reborn, you download the Five Reborn EXE from the website that I'll have here. Right over here. You click the download now button. Then you scroll down to client. You click the server download client button. Then you'll just take the EXE, put it you'll right click on your desktop new new folder and you just name it five reborn like what i already have here then you put the exe in there and it'll create all the files it needs in there and then you just take the exe once again and hit create shortcut i recommend using five reborn it's a lot easier to install and i think it runs better than five m does and so that's it for this video